wish I could host tent prestige lobbies. Well, worry not, friends, because I have the solution for you. Really? Yeah, you bet your sweet shorts I do. Follow me. All right. <laughs> yeah. Hello, and today we're going to be teaching you how to do JTAG mods without a JTAG for Modern Warfare 2. So, step one. Well, first you want to take the disc you got Febreze. Anti-microbial. -micro it's good for um, blocking uh, them catching you. You know, it like defends you against other people's hacks too. Just spray a nice even layer on that. You want to really scrub that in deep with a brittle pad. And remember to go in a circular motion when you're done, because it'll fit with the rotations of the disc. And you can even, I mean, a little bit of toothbrush in there. Just to like get the finer grit in there. Oh right, I almost forgot safety glasses. Okay, once you're done with this, I'm gonna go to a high cream and dirt thing after you, you wipe it on the carpet. Get this. It's a little dirty, you take the dirt soil treatment, put it nice and on there. Once again, you rub it in, circular motion. It's pretty easy so far, we only got a few steps left. Okay. And after this. You want a tire foam. It's important. Tire foam first. All the way around. Not too thick. Just done with that. You move on to Lysol. And Lysol will actually dissolve the tire foam into the disc. Like so. Which allows for easier J tag. You can take a toothbrush. Kind of get most of it out. Go back to your Brillo pad. Take it in. First, vertically, then horizontally, and then in circular motion again. Okay, now that we're on these two, this is just the thermal paste. Gotta take the cap off. Right. This. this just keeps it from overheating while you G-tag, or J-tag the whole thing. Just squeeze that on there. <laughs> Scrub it in. Oh yeah. And get a good view on the uh, scrub action. Oh, that's all right. The carpet's all right. Socket wrench. I think yes. Oh, hang on. Where's Socket our, wrench. Where's our hammer? Is, uh, well, we don't have a hammer. Oh, you lost that. All right. Well. Without yeah. a hammer, you could probably. You're without a hammer? Yeah, yeah, you use the bottom. Take the bottom of device. Now, you see, you do have some dents in here, but those are placed precisely to run with the Xbox uh, laser. And when it reads that, it will read as a JTAG. You'll do it in the back, too. A few places, like there, there, there's only three on the front. As you can see, this is in fact the Call of Duty Modern Warfare Modern 2. Modern Warfare 2. Now, are you ready? We're just going to pop this no, bad no, boy no, in the Xbox. <laughs> oh, don't I forgot. It. Don't polish the front. You don't polish the top because that's got to stay good. Yep. First, uh, let's see. You want wood polish first? Even though it says wood polish, it's still good. It's actually disc polish. Good and you get a nice lemon okay. scent afterwards. Yeah, it gives you a nice lemon scent. The lemon scented uh, J tag. When your Xbox runs, when the fans actually um, expel the warm air, it'll smell like lemons. So you can turn it on when you have girls over, whatever, freshen up your entire room. Yeah. And the last one would be the uh, semi gloss. So give it a nice, shiny, shiny shape right there. Lay, you want to lay this on a little bit lighter and scrub it off. This time, only circular motion since you're on the last step. Let's get this. See? And toothbrush, circular motion. Well, the toothbrush is uh, covered in thermal yeah, paste, so scrub true. that off on the uh, Brillo pad. Because yep. you're not going to need this Brillo pad afterwards. No. Your JTAG is 100% unbannable, by yeah, the way. You actually want to burn this so you don't get caught with the JTAG hat. And then, just scrub it in gently. If there's a little residue from thermal paste, it's okay. It'll just strengthen the polish. Oh, God, that smells so bad. No, it doesn't. It smells... <laughs> it's like lemon and thermal paste. And it can also paste. get you high off inhalants. In wood gloss. 
Yeah, so now, now we're just going to put this bad boy in the Xbox 360. We are all ready. You can take your safety glasses off. Yep, you can take your safety glasses off. Now, here is the Xbox. Now we're going to put that in. Alright, so now we're closing the disc tray, putting Modern Warfare 2 in. And just let it load up. Now I'm going to pause this so I can put this on my computer and switch to the screen recorder. Listen right. to it and it's running. Oh yeah, listen to it. It's running good. It might make some weird noises at first because well, your Xbox isn't used to having a JTAG mod in there. But after those noises, you're all good. And you can just start the game up. Um, see, wait a second. Just hang on. It's making those weird noises. Disconnected. You're going to get disconnected at first because it's going to say you got an update. And that's just the installing uh, update for the JTAG. And, yeah, once it installs, you're all set. Go and talk. Well, as you can see right now, you can see the little green square on there. That's the aim block you've got. Let's see. Well, Showing the Red Tiger M16. Look at that, Joe. Insane explosive ammunition, laser sight, everything. And this is the greatest part right here. I think he's going to do it. Uh, handgun. <laughs> Automatically, you got 10 proceeds there. All the challenges, you're working on them right now. You can go out of the map completely. You can float, and there's a Harrier nuke. That is the coolest shit. And, I mean, this is incredible what you can do with this. It's untraceable, unbannable. You can't get banned with any of this. I mean, nobody, you, I don't think anybody can even see your kill cams with this thing on. Just so they don't know. They're never going to report you for it. You're never going to lose any rep. Golden Desert Eagle, infinite ammo. I mean, this is insane. Explosive ammunition. They're, they're, these kids are going to be raped. You're, you're going to get, like, so many nukes off this. 25 to 30 nukes, I can guarantee, in just a few days. And I think, what's he doing right here? Yep. Disco flashbangs. Got up in the air. Look at those crazy visual effects. Can't you fly around as a uh, stealth bomber? Have to put it in third person. Oh, uh, right. Well, for the stealth bomber, you'd have to put it in third person, but if you choose to fly around as a stealth bomber, Harrier jet, care package, whatever, they will all see you. And just be like, what the fuck? Um, is this about it for our demo, guys? Yeah, stop it now. Alright, see you later. later.